If you're a dad or a man in 2019, then you know uh, exactly how hard it is out there. You have to, uh, you gotta work your ass off. You gotta be financially stable. You have to be environmentally friendly, socially conscious, politically informed. You have to take care of your kids and uh, support your wife and be supported by her. You have to help out around the house. Um, you gotta eat the right foods and try and stay fit. You can't drink too much. Um, you have to nurture your family relationships and your friends and you gotta be there for them. And you gotta do all of that while staying calm and cool and collected and well-dressed and funny. And then on top of that, if you're trying to make any kind of changes to your life, improvements to yourself, optimizations in any way, um, the single most important thing that you can start doing first uh, to get yourself going is to sleep. Uh, it was either Vince Lombardi or General George Patton that said, fatigue makes cowards of us all. Uh, you gotta sleep. That's the first place that you, got to, that you have to start prioritizing over anything else. If you're gonna start working out, you gotta sleep. Um, if you're gonna start uh, trying to work harder uh, or work longer hours at work, you gotta sleep. You, you wanna stop drinking, wanna stop eating sugar, quit smoking, uh, being a better dad, a better spouse or partner, whatever, you gotta start with sleep. I want you to think about your life right now and if nothing else changed but you suddenly started getting uh, three or four hours less sleep, you can quickly see that everything will sort of start to fall apart pretty quickly. It's like sleep is like the linchpin of everything um, and it's super important for your body. Like while you're sleeping, um, your body is releasing all kinds of hormones and doing all kinds of repair on all of your tissues. Um, people that get even one or two less hours of sleep have poor reaction time, poor alertness, poor mood. Your body is basically like a meat vehicle that carries around your consciousness and your, your body needs that sleep or, or your consciousness is gonna suffer and you're going to just have a hard time making uh, doing anything that's difficult. And if you're trying to change how you're behaving or make changes to your life, getting from point A to point B, it's gonna be a tough journey along the way no matter what it is. And you gotta have sleep to set that foundation and to give you the resources that you need to uh, be that better person. So set yourself a bedtime. If it's late right now while you're watching this video, turn it off, go to bed. Don't have another beer, don't have another glass of wine, don't watch another episode of whatever show you're watching. Get your ass to bed and get some sleep. I want you to imagine what, it, what it's gonna be like in the morning if you stay up for another hour or two, uh, or when you don't hit your bedtime, you're gonna wake up and you're just gonna have that miserable feeling with that burningness behind your eyes and the whole world gets framed in that like negative lens that you just can't escape without another two hour nap and everything gets harder when you're not sleeping. Um, you have like a negative mindset. Um, I, for me personally, I feel sad and uh, just hopeless. So you gotta get that sleep if you're gonna try and make changes in your life. If you're trying to like uh, diet or work out, you're, it's gonna be harder to, to keep that discipline and that self-control because you're gonna start just thinking, you know, what's the point of doing this? I'm just gonna, uh, you know, go off my diet or uh, not work, not go to the gym, not work out. I'm not gonna accomplish my goals, so why should I even try it? It starts to feel like that about every single thing you're doing. But when you do sleep, you're gonna have those emotional resources to tackle that side project or that hustle that you wanna get going. You're gonna have the emotional resources to be there for your kids, to be there for, the, be there for your wife. Um, you're gonna be able to deal with obstacles and to be patient. You know, if you get home uh, from work and you have other stuff that you gotta do, if you gotta take care of kids, you have other, other responsibilities, you can do those knowing that you're gonna have the resources later on in the evening to invest in your side project or your hustle or the other changes that you're gonna try and make in your life. If you want to acquire or maintain that aggressive mindset that's gonna get you where you wanna be, sleep is the very first thing that you gotta start doing. So get to bed.